the area of the region which is collection of all x y satisfying two inequalities one is x square plus 4x plus 2 is less than equal to 2 another is y less than equal to mod of x plus 2 so two boundary line curves are y equal to x square plus 4x plus 2 which can be written as x plus 2 whole square minus 2 and the other curve is y is equal to mod of x plus 2 we need the area between them so let's sketch these two graphs first one y equal to x plus 2 whole square minus 2 will be an upward parabola whose vertex is negative 2 comma negative 2 we can bring this negative 2 on the side and it is of the nature x minus alpha whole square equal to 4 a y minus beta which is shifted upward parabola so its vertex is negative 2 and negative 2 it will be somewhere in the third quadrant and graph will be something like this uh, yes negative 2 and 2 are the vertex something like this now for the second one y equal to mod of x plus 2 its critical point is also having same x coordinate negative 2 comma 0 so from here it will be starting and it will be going like this it will also pass through the same point on the y-axis 0 comma 2 so graph of y equal to mod of x plus 2 will be v shape and we need this area this area is what we want because y is less than equal to mod so below this mod graph and y is greater than equal to this so above this so we need this area so we got the this x coordinate as negative 4 comma 2 and this x coordinate as 0 so 0 comma 2 these two are at the same y coordinate and we'll be getting in by solving these two means when you solve uh, x plus 2 whole square minus 2 is equal to mod of x plus 2 considering mod of x plus 2 is t it will be t square minus 2 equal to t which gives you t square minus t minus 2 equal to 0 so mod of x plus 2 which is t equal to 2 x values are 0 and negative 4. Now using properties of parabola for the area part, this area will be 2 third of area of rectangle, this rectangle. So rectangle area is how much? Base into height, length into breadth. So it will be 2 from here and 4 from here. So that will be 2 into 4. That is area of this part. Similarly for this part also will be multiplying by now that will give you this area, but we have to subtract the area, this to get the required area. So minus this area of triangle, which is half into base into height. So half base is of four unit and height is of two unit. So half into four into two. Let's simplify this. This will be two into two, four, 16, 32 by three minus four. So it will turn out to be 20 by 3. Let's see, 20 by 3 is in which option? So 20 by 3 is option number C, and yes, that is answer given. 